Morning, Mr. Armistead. No, thank you. I've not offered you one yet. Offered me a what? A cigarette. I had no intention of doing. Good. Do you fancy some chewing gum? Good morning. Oh, nice to see you again, Mr. Armistead. Brought my own lemon, thank you. And I embrocation. I never said a word. Nobody offered you a lousy lemon. Would you like to go before the League Committee? Would you like to go to hell? I've been, laddie. That's what I'm doing here. Ball. <sighs> no corner flags again, I notice. It's the last time I'll lend anything to the YWCA. Pearls of wisdom from one who knows. What we're now about to witness is called a football match. Not the beginning of World War III, not the destruction of the human race. A football match. In it, each of the teams will attempt to score more goals than the other. What are you looking at? Not much. That will be done by kicking the ball in the net as opposed to kicking other people in the crutch. Right. Great. Thank you. Should we start? We're going to stand here and freeze to death. If I see a good, clean exhibition of football skill, you won't know I'm here. If, on the other hand, and acting according to the new gospel, according to Lytham St. Anne's, as any foul tackles from behind, shirt pulling, swearing at me, dropping dead with St. Vitus' dance because some other player accidentally looks at you, out comes my little book, and in it goes the name. Arguing with the referee will naturally not be tolerated. Well, who the bloody hell's arguing? Are you trying to get yourself in the Guinness Book of Records? The only player to be sent off before the game's even started. Like a bloody tape recorder. Did you speak? No, I was yawning. Heads or tails? Tails. Heads it is. As we are. <sighs> May the best team win. Why? 